From ABC News, live in Times Square, Tuesday, February 5th, 2013. This is Good Morning America. But first, let's get the inside scoop on Kim Kardashian's secrets to staying fit while pregnant. It's been just over a month since Kanye West announced that he and his girlfriend Kim are expecting. Four months into her pregnancy, many are wondering how the reality TV star is maintaining her figure. Well, this morning, her trainer, Tracy Anderson, is here with everything you need to know. We'll talk live with her in just a moment. But first, here's ABC's Abby Boudreaux. The eternal question, how'd she do it? Hollywood moms shedding so much baby weight so fast. We're going to take our arms up like this, and then we're going to drop them down. Celebrity trainer Tracy Anderson says the secret to getting your body back is keeping in shape during pregnancy. I used to have, you know, so many women coming to me after pregnancy like, oh my gosh, how can you get my body back? And I'm like, if I only just had you during the pregnancy too. She should know. She's credited with transforming the hot bods of A-list moms like Jennifer Lopez. Gwyneth Paltrow, and now Kim Kardashian. Okay, so how's it going? She's amazing. I was refreshed to hear her first, like, I'm pregnant and I want to do this right and I want to do this healthy. Tracy filmed her new DVD series, The Pregnancy Project, while she was pregnant, offering moms-to-be specialized workouts for each month of their pregnancy, focusing more on the body's muscular structure than on cardio. It, she was pregnant during she was filming, so she knew exactly what limitations she could put on her body. So you're saying it's possible to have a better body post-baby than before you were even pregnant? A hundred percent. I have a better body now after my second baby than I had before pregnancy. But after the baby, hitting the gym can be tough too. I know that firsthand. So I'm hoping Tracy can help me with some post-baby booty tips. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can are tight, Missy. Good job. It's going to make you feel so much better. She says I feel better after this. <laughs> I'm not so sure. But I'm sure Kim will have an easier go, despite the occasional craving, like this McDonald's McGriddle, though she says she only had one butt. I don't care what happens during her pregnancy, everybody should watch her right after it because she will be back better than ever fast. And no doubt, the world will be watching. For Good Morning America, Abby Boudreaux, ABC News, Los Angeles. All right, well, it's so great to have Tracy Anderson with us now. Her DVD, The Pregnancy Project, has all the tricks to keeping you in shape while you're expecting. Yeah, you and we have this I'm great at. group of moms to be here to show us how it's all done. That Tracy, thanks for They're being so with amazing, us. They're aren't they? Thank you for having us. And I'll admit, I use both of my pregnancies to not work out like, as my excuse. And I think a lot of people are afraid you're afraid you're going to do something I mean, wrong. Look at you. you know what? Th that's know, so valid. And you really, <laughs> doctors, <laughs> experts, they know a lot. But we don't know as much as the, as, as the mother. You know, I'm a dance aerobics you know, queen, and I don't do any jumping during my pregnancy. It doesn't have to be high I impact. Do, yeah, I only do the muscular structure work because there's this hormone relaxin that's in our bodies to help our hips and everything change shape so we can keep certain things awake and alert and connected and that's what the pregnancy project is all about that hormone stays in our body six months after wow. pregnancy so we can actually use that to our advantage to get our bodies back if we keep things awake that makes so much sense so you are actually as we mentioned helping kim stay fit yeah. while she's pregnant show us some of the moves you have been giving her to work on great she's doing fantastic and our moms are going to follow oh. along okay ladies by the way these ladies i mean they look they look amazing so um we're going to take one one weight and we're going to take it behind us so we're going to work our, our bicep and our arms and then we're going to stabilize ourselves as we kick our leg back now during pregnancy you know we've got a major vein our vena cava that we can't lay on our our backs during pregnancy because that you know can interrupt blood flow to the uterus so we can work our abs in ways like this where it's not a direct hit but we're, we're keeping everything weight like we're using our abs to stabilize our body so you're you're working on your core yeah yeah while we're working on our butt and our arms and everything we're also also taking the pressure off of our back by letting our bellies hang, which feels good, right, ladies? How long, how many times should you do this a week? How long should you do this for? You know what? You should really connect to your body each day if you can. If you don't feel like it and you're having a day where you just feel like you need to lay in bed or do whatever you need to do, then you have to do that. You know, but just make make the effort each day to have that little conversation with yourself. Can I work out today? You know, and have the tools there in the comfort of your own home in a nice place to where you can stay in your flats. Oh. 
and move if you feel it. Great tips. And you know, I feel incredibly lazy right now as I'm standing here watching all of these pregnant women exercise, but I guess I wore the wrong clothes. Tracy Anderson, thanks so much. And moms to be, thank you so much for being with us. After your workout, be sure to eat right too. That's also a good tip. And uh, goodmorningamerica.com on Yahoo. Uh, you can find three of Tracy Anderson's smoothie recipes. All right, time now for Sam with the